In the previous video, we talk about E1 and E2 elimination reactions. Now we are going to talk about the other elimination reaction, E1CB reaction. In this E1CB reaction, a bad leaving group can leave the molecule like hydroxyl group in here. The key component here is a carbonyl group that can stabilize an ion. The proton adjacent to the carbonyl group is acidic, thus base can attack the proton and pushes the electron towards the carbonyl oxygen. The resulting anion here is stable enough due to the delocalization into the carbonyl group. This anion can also be represented in the carbonyl form though it is less realistic. The next step, although this anion is stable enough, it still prefers to lose a leaving group. Thus, the electron movement now pushes the hydroxyl group to leave the molecule, forming this double bond. To summarize, in E1CB, the first step is deprotonation, which is the fast part of the reaction. Then, the elimination step of the anion, which is the rate determining step. Looking at its name, E1CB stands for E for elimination, 1 means unimolecular, so it only has one substrate in the red low, which is the elimination part, and CB stands for conjugate base, the negatively charged version of the starting material. One of the perfect candidates for E1CB reaction is beta halo carbonyl compound because halogen is a good leaving group and the beta hydrogen is also acidic. For some exercise, draw the mechanism of the following reaction. The first part of the reaction is lactonization in acid. Then, the E1CB process of eliminating chlorine, triethylamine attacks the acidic proton, pushes electron towards carbonyl oxygen. Then, the electron movement to eliminate chlorine from the molecule forming the product. We can compare the mechanism of every elimination reaction. In E1 reaction, the leaving group leaves the molecule first, forming a carbocation. Then, base comes along for deprotonation. In E2 reaction, deprotonation and loss of leaving group happen at the same time. In E1CB reaction, base deprotonation happens first, forming carbonion. Then, the loss of leaving group happens next. Here is the summary for today's video.